session and the tips just rattled round first sign of ad but it's not going to be a carp I guess it's a, a skimmer yeah there it is not really what we're after but a fish nonetheless Hi, I'm Andy Finlay and today I'm down on the lizard pool on Makings. Uh, it's very cold, it's winter time, middle of February. I suspect the water's round about four or five degrees. So we're down here trying to catch a few carp on probably the method that wins more matches than any other method during this time of month, time of year, sorry, the bomb and corn. I'm suspecting that the fishing is going to be very difficult today. Uh, it might be that, you know, we're really struggling for bites. So if that situation arises, then I'll also need to, to, to fish with another method in between to try and keep fish coming or at least catch a few decent fish for the cameras. So as well as the bombing corn, I'll be fishing a pole uh, quite a long pole, you know, you got, you got to remember that the fish go out towards the middle of the lake in the winter so obviously you need the length there to try and get near the fish and I'll also show you the, the best ways of, of feeding and presenting the bait on that. So I'm going to quickly strip this rig down and set it up from scratch and show you exactly how I use it. Well, these fish really are turning on now. In fact, I'm quite surprised that the time of year, now cold the water is and, and everything else, that the fish are turning on so quick. Must have something to do with the, it started off quite cloudy today, did, but as you can see now, the sun's come out, the wind's picked up slightly. Still really cold, but I think it's just been enough to raise the temperature a degree or so. It's fighting quite well. You don't really want to leave where a, a hook the fish, which isn't really what you want, you know. The less you've got a fish fighting to get away in the, in the, in the area where you've been loose feeding, then there's a chance of it spooking the others, so it's best to try and get the fish out of the, the target area as soon as possible. It's coming this way now though. Again, just raise your rod when the fish is nearer to you. You know, try and get it up near the surface, ready for netting. Just take your time at this stage because the last thing you want to do is, is, is to touch the hook length with the rim of your landing net. So be very careful 
when the fish is near the landing net that it, it don't swim towards it and could even cut off your line if you're not careful. It's a common carp this time, looks quite a nice conditioned fish. It's about ready now. The beauty. You don't need too many fish like that to win in the winter. <laughs> 